Hey there, everyone. This is Kyle Cow playing VD, uh, VDLC 11. 21st place by Slack Michael with the double K. I'm just completely erase any trace of the title screen. I hope you don't mind. Well, I do hope I enjoy it also. Well, I mean, considering you made it to 21st place, just on the cusp of the top 20 in a contest that has been filled with like outright gems. I think peeps have indeed enjoyed your level. We got snow going on here, but this is the frozen way. Frozen way to Kentucky. I heard this music before. I've heard this box sound before. You can walk on just fine, including enemies. Some objects won't work by being frozen. Oh. I feel like you're okay, so like this doesn't work. That's what you mean. Got it. But I guess what you're saying, no, like, okay, so there's, like, frozen bullet bills somehow in the frozen waste zone. Don't, so, does that mean you can go on these? Yeah, see, they don't work because they'd be frozen. Does the platform work? Because it'd be, okay, see, so don't work in the sense that it stays frozen in the air. Got it. So that can probably ain't gonna shoot, that radish ain't gonna rad, and that plant ain't gonna mant. Well, I'm getting that Dagadon. Well, I could by resummoning it and, you know... Popping this killer man. Hey, turn around. What a jerk. What a Frank Sinatra appreciation. So here we got the reset door. There's no R on it or anything. You just have to guess. Check it out. I'm inside a mountain zone. Inside the castle where you can climb the guys and it up in a pipey place. Alright, I don't know where I'm at. I'm like a little frozen. I'm like, I kind of want to play the unfrozen version. Like, it seems to be. An interesting, if fairly difficult, level, honestly. Right, what's over here? That swim, it's not frozen. So this is the kind of pipe that, like, puts you kind of- Okay, so that'd be right over there. That's what I missed. The swimp, a couple of guys just chilling out. Skeleton, ain't nobody got time for Freeze Mark. He's a fictional character that no one's got time for. So, uh... That's why you were invented. I'm sorry, guy. I, ha I have a tendency to inventing characters who only exist to suffer. I don't know why. That silly swamp! It can't go- Oh, I can go in this pipe. The pipe ain't frozen. The music took a turn. Everything is vaguely purple. That swamp isn't frozen at all. But I acted like he was. Well, that pipe is frozen. It's, it's, it's blue. If it's blue, it's frozen, man. That's how it works. I'm currently sitting down on a chair that has a blue ba blanket, like, covering it. It's frozen. It's a frozen blanket. Can't use that to join the Montreal Oilers, as I made several hockey mistakes there. <laughs> Were they on purpose or not? French fries! Alright, so check it out. This flower is gonna thaw the world. I'm just gonna jump in that fire before I have time to thaw the world. How about that? Ah, uh, that bounce. Uh, powerful color. You can go up there if you want. I don't know what that vine wants, but I'm taking the alternate way. Uh oh, and almost fell there. See, it's for not only a commemorative coin as the words Yoshi, the Yoshiest horse that ever was. Uh, well, you got yourself a cape, man. It's all good. Whoa, double five. Well, there goes my cape, I guess. I was just too enthusiastic about sliding all over the place and out of control. That's me. I got the feeling like, uh, no? Okay, there's the last Agadon. All right. So, because, like, there was another path, right? So I thought... Uh, I love how it's, like, pieces of levels. Like, what was going on in the original level here? It's kind of disorganized. All right, so... The difficulty here is that you got ghosts, like, spread around, so all you really have to do is shepherd them in this way, then you can just chill out as Big Boo makes land disappear and ghosts are rude and make faces at you. Well, I'm gonna deface your blocks! You gotta make a face? I'm gonna unmake that face! How about that, ghost? This is always neat! I feel like if this was a chocolate or just... Just no no limit contest. You would have like the unfrosted version you could play and it'd be pretty wild. There's a red switch up here. Noir Neptune. What? Oh man, so black. 
So Neptune-y. <laughs> All right. Maybe this is like traces of something else going on. Who knows? Let's make strange non-comments that don't really mean anything. Eternity Lava officially begins. The top 20 of this contest. Uh, yeah, this is, this is the opening message. You can pretty much autocomplete it at this point, honestly. I kind of, I find it interesting that the further up the contest we go, the more people I feel are getting clever with their tile screen and messages and maps, you know? Like, it's not like guaranteed, but it's happening more. I don't know. Have sweet dreams. It's an order. It is a command. <laughs> Alright, well there's a door, a rocket door, it's now just in the background. Alright, so we're gonna have a more like weird, surrealistic experience. Block, ink, dot, my guard is in the fence. By that I meant like the, the, the square where my power-ups would be is flashing. You know, that kind of thing. All these doors, what do you mean? I go inside a thing and now I'm somewhere else in need. Alright, so we've got layers of reality. So you got a layer in the back, a layer in the front, a layer in the aspartame and gym killer bees. So keep that in mind and look behind you. But I was not looking behind me at all. I am dreaming of footballs, been playing with baseball. Alright, well, okay. So level's taking a turn for the trickier here. With this assault, weapons being flung my way. Death Spheres, Arizona Studio. Well, that's just fine. That's just how we operate as humans. I don't know if I am safe anywhere in the world. Not really, but I can pretend. Oh shoot! I thought you were only throwing five baseballs, but no, you were throwing six. All right, take two. This time, like, don't get bopped in the back, maybe? Maybe. It's a big maybe, though. Where are you so... Is there seriously no power-ups until the little masquerade zone here? Okay. There's something threatening. Like, I know level is a lot of, like, bright pink and white squares that kind of look like Pop-Tart. Oh, you're supposed to balloon underneath here. Hey, buddy. Yeah, thought that was happening. Uh, um, now I can't go up there. Because I lost my balloon due to sports. Now there's a common story. So how do you avoid the mark of the sportsman? Because he's like he's gonna jump up and he didn't get me. I was gonna say he's gonna jump up and... What's with the, like, extreme difficulty of this? Difficult. Ah, dude, come on. Actually, if I'm not going on a balloon expedition, the smart thing to do is to double up. Okay, so... Still don't get anything bigger than a mushroom, so it's this kind of level. That's fine. I think maybe we can use balloon to go up instead. Like, I just don't think that the... The Dagadon that's in there, that's like inside that little corridor is worth it. Like, it's just... So outrageously difficult. Well, okay, I'm exaggerating wildly here. In case you didn't realize it. But, uh, no, yeah, though, still. Like, it is, like, a lot harder. I don't know. I don't know what to expect. The coins, I'm assuming, are nice. They were not. Well, I mean, if I wasn't holding a, a thing, I would have been fine. But I was holding a thing. Like, that, therein lies the problem. Well, I can still get you there, though. Alright, so I mean, yeah, like, coin- well, I don't know. Is that coin guy fair? I just thought uh, you have to know that you have to be able to hold up. Alright, uh, I think that's where it wants me to go, like, this is not an option. Oh, that guy there is just walking through that block like it was nobody's business, so, yeah, but... No, you still gotta go inside that one door. If you have a chance beyond the hopes and dreams of the fellow human... Kinda neat. Just have, oh, this is kind of silly. <laughs> All right. Okay, you can't see really the line there, but you don't need to because you see the little life preserver that denotes the limitation 
between existing and a brief fallacy. Quick imitation. That's a silly pokey! Alright, that, uh, well, yeah, um, I tackled that the wrong way. I keep thinking they're gonna fall, which I don't think you can make falling vines? Not in smooth, not vanilla. So I don't know why I keep thinking that. Alright, you get help for that pokey in case you can't get over him. You, you got, yeah, midpoint. Yeah, no, this level got kind of serious. Well, it got. It has always been serious. Just because it's about dreams doesn't mean you can't come clean. <laughs> come clean, yes. That's what I always do. Alright, so signs want me to go in that direction. Just a single mushroom, just kind of resting there. It's a dream mushroom, so it's probably gonna give you warts that talk. It give you answers to that exam you didn't study for, and that you don't know in what class it is. Because turns out you never actually went to that class? How did you manage to do that? Like, that's not in character for you, but here we are. Here we are. I got hit a lot there, and pretty avoidable ways, by, by pretty avoidable means of danger. But I was kind of slow on the uptake. I don't got a blue switch. How about you? How about you? Oh, geez, swim surprise. <laughs> swim squared me. Please don't square me, okay? Rectangles are fine. All right. But I don't want to be squat. Now I auto scroll the clouds and also known as bushes in the background are moving. I don't know what's going on. I don't know why there's coins at the bottom. Hey there, Richard. How do you do? Uh, okay, I think I'm gonna do that. Like, I understand the logic that you probably want to move around them quite a bit. But I feel like only having to deal... Well, that's neat. Putting a hole in this kind of thing. It's kind of clever. And I love, like, the big haunted house wall going on with, like, still the clouds moving in the background. It's a really neat effect. This whole place is super rad. <laughs> like, this is really imaginative. There's a lot of really fun stuff going on. Alright, I made it through the pain wall without any pain. Don't need bread here. Alright, this is not a call to get hurt in a dumb way, though. Let's be calm, I say, noticing my time. Oh, that's a green springy thing that had the green removed. That's sad. Alright, so uh, oh, there's a last I get on. The first one's the only one I didn't get. It was kind of out of characteristically hard to get. There goes the storm! It's just a norm sitting there on a cushion, waiting for breakfast to be delivered. Where here's a big hearty meal, Mario Orb Zone. I don't know if my dream was sweet, but I had a lot of fun playing it. So bygones be bygones. Empt. Oh, you can do here and give you an advantage. Like. This, oh, okay. That's an idea. And you can press any switch you want. And then you just better get a big rectangular void that swallows you up. And that counts as a life loss. But since you have unlimited lives, it doesn't really have much of an impact. Yeah, this, this was great. And it says VLDC, you know. Uh, Venezuela legend, the sea's crab. 1-1. One, one. Here we go. Upgrade that version. What's the button I have to press? 